You may recall this statement from Sleeping Warrior Anthony Riley in 2019. Weigh a balloon, inflate it, weigh it again, it'll be heavier. Do you now accept it uh, has weight? Uh, no. It took a little time for quantum eraser John Stunja to arrive at the truth of Riley's groundbreaking scientific research, but apparently he has done so now. Listen as John enthusiastically agrees with Adam Meekin that gases themselves have no weight. Yeah, weigh it. You can't weigh it. Um, it, is an it is, is not expressible by gas. Free movement. You, the, the only way to do it would be to take your bit of gas and say, look, at room temperature and pressure, this gas that occupies this volume, I will contain it describe those parameters there i will now then take it um, and phase transition it into either a liquid or solid to make it weighable anything else is back calculated so what you would do and what's been calculated is say nitrogen for example you can calculate the weight of nitrogen because we freeze the freaking thing once we know its volume and weigh it and but it, we, what we can't so it's it's just a can say it has that weight it doesn't it never has weight um sorry just said it never has weight as a gas it's only when you convert it into a liquid or a solid that it then will have a weight oh go ahead finish up yeah that's it. That, that's it you know you can't have a weight of a gas to me you have a, a volume and a pressure to describe it accurately you can't describe I've never ever if i'm dealing with gases i can't take a weight of a gas a volume and a pressure if I want it accurately, don't I? Because I want to know how many molecules I've got. Right. Right. That that's a very I, I'm I'm following you conceptually with that, Adam. Even then it, 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 it's a conceptual thing. Because to conceptualize weight of a gas, you have to conceptualize it in its other forms to give it that right. conception. It doesn't have a weight. Otherwise. Right. I see what you're saying. And other, even other than and a single molecule of itself have that weight it wouldn't express that weight on anything it would express a pressure it's right. moving freely and randomly right it's an expression of right yeah i'm following you with that you uh, conceptually you're correct even yeah. and even then when you say remember you have to say weight you're still attached by the lips to the convention Right? Oh, he's, he's you on a phone call? No, 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 no. I'm a chemist. So all there is is weight. All they tried to do with remember that uh, chemistry used to be called atomic weight. It's now called atomic mass. The only reason is to bring in G. They only right. have weight. The only measurable thing is weight. You know, when we're dealing with solids and liquids, we measure them in weight. We can use weight for gases. We can't. Um, Anything else is a convention that's mathematically applied. So right. you'll say, you know, it's actually got this mass times G gives you its weight. No, you measured its weight. The rest you made up. Yeah, exactly. You got it. Yeah. Folks, Adam. That's is, why I asked the question. A, that's why I asked it. Thank, thanks, Chocolate. Adam is lifting the veil up. People in the audience, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, did you catch what he just said? If you didn't. Go back and listen to it again on this recording. It's profound what he just said. Thank you.
like to travel round and round the circus. This is my home. I always see the road. In the rocket ship I soar, I explore the ocean floor. But you must know I'll never go unless you come along. Bojo, Bojo, always last, never frown. Bojo, 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 the clown. <laughs>